हाय प्रीति हाय सशिकाल जी सशिकाल वेलकम टू कैन पंजाब थैंक यू सो मच थैंक यू फॉर हैविंग मी हाउ आर यू फीलिंग आई एम गुड आई एम गुड हाउ आर यू ग्रेट थैंक यू तुसी कनाडा है क्यों हां जी कनाडा ओके सो इस टाइम पे की टाइम होया उठे इस टाइम 7:30 इन द मॉर्निंग Preeti, tell me. Okay, tell me about yourself, Preeti. I have uh, read some really wonderful things about you. You've been a pageant winner, and uh, you know, from a journey to a girl from uh, Uganda to winning a pageant, and uh, then going towards becoming a Punjabi singer. So, tell me the journey. How did it go? Where were you born? Uh, I was born and brought up in Uganda, and. Um... uh actually my my dad was born in uganda too my grandfather moved uh, there quite some time back and they had a family business mm-hmm. so uh, my dad was born there and then you know, uh, we've all been brought up there so yeah the beauty pageant came to me uh, in 2009 uh, uh, before that i did a fashion show it was a charity fashion show so the organizers uh, you know approached me for the pageant and uh, approached some other girls as well so when i was approached uh, you know this is something that i've always dreamt of as a young girl you know watching uh, watching pageants on tv so it's something that i always wanted to do so when i got the opportunity i, I was like you know why, why not and um, uh, it was the first time that uh, this pageant took place in uganda so i just tried my luck and i won and then uh, you know i went oh, to um, okay. all white pageant <coughs> mm-hmm. sorry um, So over there, there were uh, girls from over forty countries that came, and you know we competed. And uh, even in that, I was first second, and then you know top six. And so it was it was overall a very wonderful experience. And uh, yeah, from there the journey started. You know, then back to back shows, fashion shows, stage shows, um, and yeah, and uh, singing just came along the way. I don't know how. <laughs> I've always loved dancing and you know uh music has always been in me so I loved dancing but um yeah, yeah. someone told me like you know you should try singing so I was like sure why not <laughs> you know you never know what works so you didn't you. get any so, training for this um I have taken a little bit of training uh I wouldn't say uh, I've got the proper training I I I really want to uh but uh, yeah no nothing like you know the uh, more professional level you would say uh, i've not had that training but uh, i definitely want to learn more now that you know my two songs are out and people are loving it so i feel as a person mm. like you know i need to improve on uh, the skills you know just to uh, okay. if it, because i believe if i'm doing something i need to do it the right way and i always love right. learning new things so you know why not i definitely want to learn So how how about we uh, start with your first song today? I mean, why don't you hum it for us and tell us about it a little more? Okay, so the first song we released in Jan, uh, it's called Doubt. So that was January twenty twenty. Yes, this year. Okay. Okay. Yeah. So um, <clears throat> I'm sorry, my my throat is it's just early in the morning and you know it is shut. Go ahead. Go ahead. <laughs> गुस्से जंग संधुवा तू कहना बाला कर दा प्यार फिर कास तो वे मन तेरा डोल दा रिश्ते यकीन ना सॉरी हम्म इट्स ओके इट्स ओके बोल दे हॉर्स इज हेल्पिंग मी रिश्ते यकीन नाल चल दे वे मैं तेरी या तेरी या छड डरना जो छड खेड़ा होर लब ले जा छड दे मेरे ते डाउट करना जो छड खेड़ा होर लब ले सो देयर गोस द लाइन फॉर द फर्स्ट सॉन्ग ओके वेरी नाइस सो ए किने लिखया सीगा ए जन संधू जी ने लिखया एंड म्यूजिक प्रोड्यूस बाय जे एस एल सिंह एंड सारे डायरेक्टर्स के प्रवीण बाद ही इज फ्रॉम दिल्ली 
so yeah bahut hi badhiya team se ki like you know it it felt like a family and uh, everyone was uh, so into the project so it it really turned out great very nice so thoda dooja project bhi jsl de naal hi aaya hai and prabeen bhat right haan ji so why do you stick around with the same team uh the thing is uh, eh uh, jada project se actually first uh, sada jada collab hoya si sare matlab ikattheya si uh, socha si uh, project karan nu so doubt si uh, sada main project but as we hmm. you know went along and uh, you know things started moving and uh, praveen bhat ji and uh, you know jaisal pa ji they had to fly down from india to toronto for the shoot so mm-hmm. if they mm-hmm. gal karte ka they were like you know uh, we have a week's time might as well shoot two songs hmm. so if they you know just like pajit kya han ji i i have a, you know i have another song that if you're interested in so your know, second song uh, supreet ji ne likha uh, that's also very nice so asi socha ki chalo you know might as well just shoot two songs and fir ho janda na kyunki kai baar hunda hai artists you know they get into this industry so they release a song and then kafi time ho janda hai they don't release anything and then you know people forget right. so i didn't want that yeah. to happen with me cuz I wanted to give you know back to back songs so you know um, everything is coming in the next few days so I was like sure you know why not those songs kathe shoot kar lo we can you know like uh, have a gap and then just release them so that was the plan and uh, hmm. that's why you know the same people uh, are in the team but definitely you know uh, projects are had we uh, I'm collaborating with the other artists as well and kafi uh, uh, versatility dikhogi tonu please great so aaj main ek gal dasu jo tota pehla gana aaya so what was the feedback that you got from people the good and the bad very frankly uh i got a lot of good feedback uh, uh, you know in the sense that okay jara mainu jande ya right ona to because mainu ona to first feedback ona to mili ke you know we are we really uh, proud that you know you you're doing something uh, you know other than the pageants fashion shows and you know you trying to get into uh, the mainstream but uh, uh people uh, you know like uh, you do get a lot of negative comments too uh, i won't lie uh, i did get a, a little bit of criticism about my weight and uh, uh, you know like uh, here and there i don't quite recall right now but uh, i think i think those are the things that make you a better person though you know you try to get those right. points and uh, you know um, but at that time uh, if you see like as uh, uh, last year june july shoot kita siga and from that hmm. time till now i just lost about 15 kilos <laughs> so, so why you know, was it so necessary uh, to lose weight mhm no it, it was not uh, because of the criticism i got uh, losing weight was my personal thing because i've always you know being in the mm-hmm. beauty industry i've always uh, uh, like to be fit but uh, you know uh, some lifestyle changes happened and uh, at that time uh, i really wanted to shoot the video too first we were like uh, you know let's wait for some time to shoot it i think there's a small connection problem <laughs> ha so ab theek ho gaya i hon it's Hello? fine yeah yeah बट i it's not like i lost weight because of any criticism but uh, it was my personal choice mm-hmm. great yeah. okay so did it affect you when somebody called you say somebody said that you overweight and you know you called you names so did it affect you at a personal level i mean did you feel that how disgusting to see gana suno na why are you commenting on me uh at first yeah like uh, see I feel like body shaming is something that's happening a lot in our society these days. It's not necessary that if uh, you know if there is a singer coming out uh, she has to be a certain uh, body shape. No. Uh, singing is a talent, you know. Uh, 
you can have uh, singers you know uh, that are not uh, as fit as you know any uh, model would look but uh, body shaming is so unfortunately uh, like it's so unfortunate these days uh, and i don't think anybody has the right to comment on anyone about how they look because it's their personal choice right. you don't know the hardships that person is going through so i don't think anyone should comment on anyone's uh, body shape great so when uh, when when we when you were shooting for your second uh, song uh, that was tere lare right which recently released yes i'm not sure why this is happening Hi, can you hear me? Yeah, I think um uh, your video is not Ah, uh, oi, mere na bhi yahi issue ho raha hai. I'm I can't see you clearly. So god bless the internet. Kar lo 5G. Hona to fir bhi yahi hai. I'm not sure why this is happening. Probably because it's getting too hot here. So, anyways, uh, so we, I was asking you, okay, Jada, you see, Tere Lare shoot kar rahe si when you were shooting for the recent video of yours. When did it release? When was the song out? Uh, it released this month, seventh uh, May. Seventh of May. Take it. Yeah. Ode kine? I mean, what was the response? Did people come back to you and say that you have improved and you know you look better than the first one? What were the good comments that you got? uh a lot of comments about the singing like people really loved the song the vibe uh, you know uh, more than the first one i would say they they loved it, uh, this one more uh, also i think because you know we shot it in toronto so i uh, i think the the visuals were much appealing to the audience so uh, that's that but uh, obviously people don't know that these two shot uh, uh, sorry these two songs were shot back to back so one right. day we did out yeah. and the other day we did lari so you won't see a vast difference in my appearance but uh, okay. the singing okay. portion yes definitely you know uh, we shot uh, sorry we uh, we uh, recorded one song uh, the doubt song in uh, toronto and um, the tere lari song uh, i uh, you know recorded it with jsl paji in his studio in delhi so mm -hmm. that's that's the only difference but uh, Yeah, I think जरे अगले projects uh, you know lined up ने और जो काफी लोग का नो दिखेगा that uh, there's there's a vast uh, you know like we're trying to do different uh, genres and you know like the next one I'm planning is is completely different from what I've done so far. Great, great. So how about you sing तेरे लारे for us right now? <laughs> okay, I'll I'll sing the line that's. trending on tiktok these days we've had like oh great okay great videos <laughs> so right. it goes uh, tere chunila na de nani khayal tenu muchda kadar ki karni hai haal vi ni puchda assi jind jaan te to baithe hare assi jind jaan te to baithe hare hai kar de chhade sare ke jande na sahare ve jind tere lare jambara de tare Nice, <laughs> very nice. So, uh, why is it trending on TikTok? What did people like in this? Is Lare Lare because both the songs have the similarity. Because both the songs have the similarity. Yeah, so I think just the line. A lot of couples are, you know, making TikToks and sending because uh, you know the chunni part and then the much part for the guys. Yeah. So because a lot of that, yeah. So and I think also the music is amazing. Jaisal Paji ne both bolia music banana. and of course the lyrics uh, supreet has uh, mm. done a great job and um, yeah i think people are just loving the song and it's it's great okay so tell me uh, preeti jab tu si is industry pe vich aa rahi si when you were entering the singing industry what was the uh, what would you call your struggle period i mean when you were struggling what what all did you face um i wouldn't call it a struggle period honestly <clears throat> i think i've always uh, sort of planned not not planned like from a long time but just you know planned things uh, in such a way uh, 
that I, okay i want to do this i want to do this i want to try this cuz i'm a person that's very you know curious i i want to know things i want to learn things so this was something that uh, i i i decided to do you can say so you know uh, i won't say struggle but yes a lot of hard work and uh, you know a lot of dedication uh, i've kept towards whatever i want to do so yeah and uh, if if i don't know a lot of people call this the struggle period but i i feel uh, you know jada tu see hard work kar rahe ho and uh, you know jada jada agge agge projects honge so that's a journey i wouldn't call it a struggle period it's a journey and i think we should enjoy it nay i mean see the point here is that there's a lot of people uh, who promise you things but they don't do it they do it you know who are working with you but it does not turn out to be the right way right thing so did you also feel something like that or did you have such a well, instance where you know you felt cheated by somebody um no not really i like i said like you know i've always planned things so uh, these are the things that uh, we had planned uh, you know like uh, i have had had lined up so uh, there's always been a direct connection with the people i'm dealing with so never never cheated no i i don't think i've ever had that feeling so you've been lucky in that case right yes <laughs> okay so acha ek aur cheez ye hai ki tell me about the pageant life have you been there you know you've done that you've walked the ramp for the pageant and otherwise as a fashion model what is the uh, what is the good part about it that has changed in your life and the second the ugly side of this world okay so uh, like i said it was the first time that you know someone from uganda was going on such a international uh, platform and representing the country so definitely it was uh, you know a first time for even the organizers and uh, uh, of course me but uh, i feel the pageant uh, because you know there's so much that happens there's a lot of grooming you meet different people uh, i think it it just uh, it's sort of uh, you know transformed me as a person like it's changed me a lot uh, in terms of you know i i used to be a very shy person you know like not talk to uh, anyone just be in my own little corner but i've been more mm-hmm. outspoken at the pageant and you know like uh, they they groom you like you know they teach you how to talk they teach you how to walk and everything so uh, it's a very uh, it's a good learning experience and uh, for anyone who wants to join the industry you know it's it's always a uh, a learning experience and um, you should uh, like definitely uh, if if nothing like if nothing like this comes along the way i feel always a grooming class uh, is uh, you know essential for someone who wants to join the industry the ugly side i have luckily not seen the ugly side i have heard a lot but uh, i've been lucky mm-hmm. enough not to face anything of that sort and uh, you know whatever projects i've done have been uh, very uh, very nice and uh, i've i've just uh, enjoyed the experience till now who are the fashion designers you worked for so uh, i've worked for a lot uh, uh, of fashion design uh, so in uganda i did a fashion show uh, so there's a, a fashion designer her name is silvia wori she is uh, a very mm-hmm. famous famous fashion designer in uganda so i've worked for her in fact uh, in toronto when i came uh, i i worked for uh, dinesh ramse he's uh, he's one of uh, the bollywood fashion designers uh, from toronto mm-hmm. and uh, yeah these are the two mm-hmm. names the two big names that i can think of but uh, other than that i've done a lot okay. of charity fashion shows you know that are not really uh, yes you also have preet foundation <laughs> right how did that start yes preet foundation um, i started that in 2010 uh, that was after 2010. my uh, so it's been yeah. 10 years now right <laughs> yes yes so that was something uh, that you know we always had uh, in in our family like you know uh, mom dad uh, i and brother we always used to you know like uh, go and uh, donate something on you know special occasions and stuff and uh, it was always something that we wanted to do so after missing yeah i was like you know why not uh, uh, launch uh, the preet foundation and uh, do everything uh, through it 
तो या इट जस्ट स्टार्टेड आई आई डोंट थिंक आई गॉट as much uh, response as i wanted from people in terms of support mm-hmm. uh, because uh, i've done quite a number of projects and all the projects i've done have been uh, you know sponsored by my dad and uh, okay. a few of the like i think just one project we did uh, there i got a few sponsors but other than that we've always uh, you know uh, been doing this like a family thing mostly but mm-hmm. i do want to you know like bring it forward uh, now that i have the platform and you know take it to the next level and uh, help mm-hmm. in a bigger scale okay tell me pre uh, preeti uh, see when you open a foundation or when you open an ngo because these days what happens is people believe that you know ngo jada khol rahe hai na oh eda matlab hai ki oh dooje paase nu paise kamana chahunda you know this is also a myth and at some yeah. places it's also true So, ਤੁਸੀਂ ਮੈਨੂੰ ਦੱਸੋ ਕਿ ਤੁਹਾਡੇ ਵੱਲ ਵੀ ਇਦਾਂ ਦਾ ਕੋਈ ਰਿਸਪੌਂਸ ਆਇਆ ਵੈਰ ਇਨ ਪੀਪਲ ਟੋਲਡ ਯੂ ਥੈਟ ਯੂ ਨੋ ਵਾਈ ਆਰ ਯੂ ਓਪਨਿੰਗ ਐਨ ਐਨਜੀਓ ਡੂ ਵਾਂਟ ਐਨ ਐਕਸਟਰਾ ਇਨਕਮ ਕਮਿੰਗ ਯਰ ਵੇ ਡਿਡ ਡਿਡ ਸਮਬਡੀ ਕਮ ਐਂਡ ਕਮੈਂਟ ਲਾਈਕ ਥੈਟ ਆ ਨੋ ਆਈ ਨੈਵਰ ਗੋਟ ਐਨੀ ਸਚ ਕਮੈਂਟ ਬਟ ਯਾ ਪੀਪਲ ਵਰ ਆਲਵੇਸ ਹੈਜ਼ਿਟੈਂਟ ਟੂ ਯੂ ਨੋ ਡੋਨੇਟ ਐਂਡ ਕਮ ਫੋਰਵਰਡ ਸੋ ਥੈਟ ਥੈਟ ਵਾਸ ਮਾਈ ਕਨਸਰਨ ਸੋ ਜਿਹੜਾ ਇੱਕ ਪ੍ਰੋਜੈਕਟ ਕੀਤਾ ਸੀ ਅਸੀਂ ਯੂ ਨੋ ਇਟ ਵਾਸ ਫੋਰ you know water pump uh, asi karna se ka drill in one of the villages in uganda where the villagers didn't have okay. clean water <clears throat> so they used to go down mm-hmm. uh, a hill you know like uh, to fetch water and something so asi utthe pump banana si so oh kafi bada project si ga so ode le mai you know thode uh, sponsors nu approach kita si so yes a few people asked me that you know why are you doing this you know there's already a few uh, you know ngos mm-hmm. doing this already and uh, uh you know indian association hagi hai the they're doing but you know i feel zaruri nahi hai ki jo koi ngo a koi you know already kar raha hai then that doesn't mean that someone else cannot do it so i these were you know some things right. i wanted to do as a person so yeah so did that happen or you didn't yes we did the project uh, you know we we came uh, i'm not i don't recall the name of the organization but we we combined uh, mm-hmm, our projects and we did uh, we did do that yeah great so talking about canada from uganda to canada what what got you to canada studies uh i came to canada after to my marriage in 2016 Okay so you're married eh? Yes. Great congratulations. Finally there's somebody who accepts it on camera. I'm so proud of you. Oh, okay. <laughs> Why did you say that? <laughs> But everybody wants to hide their marital status. I don't know what's wrong with people these days. No, I think uh, marriage is a very beautiful phase of uh, you know anyone's life and uh, why i'm i'm being very uh, open about it is because my husband's uh, not just because of that but uh, in general also he is very supportive in fact this whole singing thing is mm-hmm. all because of him so he's the oh, one that congratulations to you for having a hobby like that <laughs> thank you thank you yeah so he's the You're one who's uh, you know who's visioned all this and is bringing it to life so yeah so what does he do so he's also into you know uh, acting uh, and the entertainment industry so uh, he has a few music uh, sorry a few movies uh, lined up in bollywood so oh he's an actor okay. still... what is his yes. name yeah. his name is preet he's uh, yet to you know uh, do the movies but uh, he's always uh, been into theater and you know all that so he's done nice. a few films and stuff So yes he's actually also the producer of the two songs. So oh, yeah. Oh very nice. Yeah. Okay. So now wh- what did your wedding card say? Preeti wedding preet. <laughs> I wish. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Nice, very nice. So okay, so what are your projects that are lined up for the coming years? So uh there's one project that's lined up. I cannot reveal much about it, but uh, uh it's a, it's going to be a duet. and the singer okay. is from the uk and uh, okay. very well known and um, 
yeah i'm really looking forward to that project because i've had two back to back singles so i'm really looking forward to the duet and uh, a pretty are you also performing show anywhere in the world uh as of now no because uh, you know jan uh, is when i released my first song and then uh, tere lare came out now and then the lockdown ho gaya <laughs> yeah. so nothing else now but definitely you know if i get uh, any opportunities like that i i would love to and i love the stage i love performing on mm-hmm. the stage i've done uh, a lot of dance shows i've hosted a lot of events so the stage is like it's it's in here <laughs> i love the Very stage nice. when i'm on the stage i'm a totally different person so yeah i would definitely love to you know do concerts and stuff so let's see what's planned ahead Okay, now this last question of mine is that you know generally what happens is that uh, when people uh, you know have a journey from the beauty pageant world, they eye at films. You know, so you're a Punjabi girl. So did you also want to get into films, or was singing your thing? Um. Yes, I I always wanted to do uh, you know uh, movies, and, uh, acting. and you know it's it's just in me <laughs> i feel dancing <laughs> acting singing uh but singing was not in um, <clears throat> sorry singing was not planned uh, on the professional level it just happened like mm-hmm. i said uh, you know uh, i was encouraged <laughs> by my husband to uh, try right. it out but, uh, i always wanted to do movies um so yeah i do have uh, one project that's been approached as well but uh, nothing is finalized yet so really hopefully things work out oh yes. wow so it's a punjabi film uh yes it's a punjabi film oh balle very nice chalo theek hai inshallah we'll see you in a uh, film soon hopefully hopefully <laughs> oh on that note i want you to hum a song for us any any one of your favorites any song okay Whom do you like uh, I really like uh, I really like Sunanda Sharma. Uh mm-hmm. I love her singing. Yeah. I love her songs. Uh, you know they're very peppy and <clears throat> that yeah. sort of encouraged me as well. <clears throat> so I'll sing her song. I love Mummy the uh, Mummy the home, the Mummy song. So <laughs> the Mummy song. <laughs> <laughs> the Mummy song. <laughs> so yeah. Um meri mummy nu pasand nahi ho tu ve tera ghar mu main dass tenu main ta vi tenu pyar kar di chand ve main ta vi tenu pyar kar di chand ve ho meri mummy nu pasand nahi ho tu ve tera ghar mu main dass tenu main ta vi tenu pyar kar di chand ve main ta vi tenu pyar kar di chand ve ਉਹ ਤੇਰੇ ਨਾਲ ਖੜੀ ਆ ਮੈਂ ਜਦ ਤੱਕ ਮਰਦੀ ਨਹੀਂ ਦੁਨੀਆ ਦੀ ਪਰਵਾਨੀ ਕਿਸੇ ਤੋਂ ਮੈਂ ਡਰਦੀ ਨਹੀਂ ਉਹ ਜਾਨੀ ਤੇਰਾ ਨਾਮ ਵੇ ਕਿੰਨਾ ਸੋਹਣਾ ਵੇ ਲੈ ਕੇ ਆਂਦਾ ਸਾਵੇ ਮੈਨੂੰ ਤੇਰੇ ਬਿਨਾ ਹੈ ਨਹੀਂ ਹੋਰ ਕੰਮ ਵੇ ਮੈਨੂੰ ਤੇਰੇ ਬਿਨਾ ਹੈ ਨਹੀਂ ਹੋਰ ਕੰਮ ਵੇ ਓ ਯੂ ਇਵਨ ਸਾਊਂਡ ਲਾਈਕ ਹਰ ਡੂ ਯੂ ਨੋ ਦੈਟ ਆਈ ਆਈ ਹਰਡ ਦੈਟ ਸਮਨ ਟੋਲਡ ਮੀ ਦੈਟ ਆਈ ਵਾਸ ਲਾਈਕ ਓਕੇ Okay okay there is a request somebody says mainu dooji baar pyar hoya sunao please now there you go you've got request coming in do you know that song wow. um i think i know a few lines okay go ahead uh, you know it, it, the other time thing and i you just go blank you you don't uh, right. remember the lines but <laughs> it happens most no, of I the time i think dooji baar pyar hoya sunaya dooji baar bhi hoya tere naal i think something like that that's the only yeah. line i remember Hanji, Hanji, Hanji. But no, thanks a lot, Preeti. I hope we didn't miss out on anything important. No, I think uh, pretty much uh, that's been my journey. Uh, you know, Miss India, fashion shows, uh, stage shows, uh, dancing, and now singing, and hopefully acting very soon. So yeah, yeah. <laughs> thank you so much for having me. Fine, then. Uh, thanks a lot, Preeti. This uh, live session. Thank you. And we will look forward to having more of these with you probably in the future more clearer with you because this one has been totally pixelated. Yeah, I know. So thanks a lot Preeti for joining us today and we hope to see you soon. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Bye Preeti.
Bye. Take care. You too. So, guys, uh, that was Preeti Panesar with us today live. Pata nahi internet nu ki hoya hai. Yahan te garmi jada pay gayi hai. E menu tang na gal nikar de raha log kana. Har te main 4G chhad ke Wi-Fi de aayi hoya. But still, chalo koi shakar nahi. Appa kal nu phir to live hoange. Phir dekh dia. Because I don't know. Kal wale interview bhi tahi menu band karna paya because of the internet. So, today the video is not clear, I was not so good to see her face clearly, but unfortunately I could not even see her face clearly. So, sorry, I didn't have to do anything, this is called a technical glitch. But hopefully, we will see you tomorrow, we will be live again, so I hope that tomorrow we will join you tomorrow. And tomorrow we will also talk about the same things, we will talk about the same things, we will talk about the same things. कुछ पुराने कुछ नवे कुछ बहुत ही वधिया कुछ नवे आ रहे हैं जेडे ओना दी वधिया गायकी सुनाएंगे प्रीति पर ऐसे जी गायकी तो अनु कितना नहीं लगी ना तो गाना है हाली देवी जी तेरे ला जेएसएल देना लाया ते ये गाना तो सी इंटरनेट पे सुन सकते हो इधर पोस्ट भी ऐसी स्वेरे पाई सी की कल नो फेर तो ऐसी so, Sardog Bani Rao Kent Punjab, I am Gurleen Kaur, signing off. Thanks for watching, guys.